everyone, welcome to day two of our 12 days of Christmas um, DIY event. So this is all about making some beautiful handmade gifts using your essential oils to enhance, to support, to promote well-being, to stay out of the supermarket, to stay away from shopping centers, um, and to give some gifts that are really thoughtful and beautiful and handmade, which is what I'm kind of all about. So today we're going to be making a really, really easy face scrub. And I think exfoliating is one of those steps that a lot of us leave out. We, we cleanse, we moisturize, we put on sun cream, we put on makeup, but exfoliating is way down the list. So we want to kind of bring that back because it is really good for your skin. It's the way that we get rid of um, sort of dead skin. It makes um, your skin um, regenerate faster. So as we get older, that kind of that process slows down and that's when our skin starts to look really dull and dry and flat. So a brown sugar scrub is the perfect thing to do for that. Um, I've got one here that I've been um, I've been using this a lot. Mine was my bottle was really old and manky, so I've made some new one so you guys can see what it looks like. But it is really really simple. So a scrub, um, it's one of the easiest things you can make. It's just literally mixing some ingredients together and putting them in a jar and making it look really pretty. So the reason I use brown sugar over any other sugar is that. First of all, we're talking about the skin on your face, so that's going to be more sensitive than other areas of your body. You can definitely use different sugars for different purposes, and we'll be talking about that uh, on Saturday when I share a hand scrub um, with you guys. But for my face, I'm going to use brown sugar. It's really, really gentle, and it also has some active ingredients in it that are actually really good for your skin. So brown sugar contains glycolic acid, which is an alpha hydroxy acid, which is probably something that you've heard of if you've got skincare purchased from department stores, AHAs are something that helps really cleanse your skin. So brown sugar facial scrub, remember to use this on your lips as well. So we tend to put lip balm, lip gloss on, but we don't actually scrub, wash our lips particularly. So all of the ingredients in this scrub are good enough to eat. So remember to do your lips as well and you will notice the difference afterwards when you've uh, done a lip scrub, lip polish and then you put your lip balm on over the top, your lips will feel amazingly smooth and soft. The other reason to use a scrub is that it makes all of the products that you put on afterwards, so your moisturizers, all of those sorts of things, it makes your skin better able to absorb them. So you're gonna stretch your products and make them work more effectively, so that's really cool. All right, so to make a brown sugar face, face scrub, you will need half a cup of brown sugar, one tablespoon of raw honey, quarter of a cup roughly of either coconut oil or olive oil or jojoba oil or almond oil, whatever oil that you like for your skin. And the oils, the essential oils that I like to use in this scrub, there are three of them. I like three drops each of lavender, lemon, and frankincense. So really beautiful oils for your skin. Lavender and frankie especially, really soothing and nourishing for your skin. Lemon is a fantastic cleanser. It's gonna to help to get rid of any grease and grime that's on your face. So three drops of each of those is perfect. If you have um, really blemish prone skin, you might like to do maybe five drops each of lemon and tea tree. If you have um, very dry skin, perhaps you might want to add some geranium into there, maybe leave out the lemon, um, replace it with geranium. There are lots and lots of options and I'm going to share a little bit more about customizing these gifts for skin type on Monday and I'll be sharing a link to my Beauty Detox ebook which you don't you may not have already. It's a, a subscriber only um, gift but I'm going to be giving that away on Monday um, when we talk about a beautiful facial serum. So the scrub would be a fantastic first step and then the um, the serum over the top and you've got an amazing gift for someone or for yourself. So this is something that you would use once a week. If you have really red, irritated, uh, inflamed skin, you want to be very, very careful using a scrub. Um, certainly, I would perhaps leave out um, 
the oils to start with, I would switch to something really, really gentle, maybe just do lavender. Um, but you certainly don't want to be scrubbing skin that's already red and inflamed. So just keep that in mind if you're gifting to someone who has some skin issues. You just want to be a little bit cautious and give them instructions on how to use it. So obviously there's no uh, preservatives in this either. So you, again, you want to be a little bit cautious. Um, I tend to keep this in the fridge, which helps um, stretch it. And I tend to use it within a couple of weeks. Um, you'll only need a teaspoon or so at a time. Um, if there's any left after that amount of time, I might um, add some raw sugar or some salt or something and use it as a body or a foot scrub as well, just to use it up and then make a fresh batch. So make this as close to the time that you're gifting it as possible and let the person know that they need to use it within a couple of weeks. So just make a small batch. So this makes quite a small batch with only half a cup of sugar. You might want to split that into two small jars and give them instructions on how to use it and to use it up within a certain um, amount of time. Um, yeah, so this is a super easy recipe. The three oils that I've mentioned, the lavender, the um, lemon and frankincense, all come in the starter kit. So if you got started with a top 10 kit, you'll have these three already. If you're looking at getting started with a home essentials kit, for example, you'll have all three of these oils in there to start playing with um, skincare. And you have lots and lots of options uh, on ways to get creative uh, using those top 10 oils for your skin and all sorts of beautiful beautiful products that you can make. So I hope you guys uh, enjoy that. I hope you give it a go. Please let me know what you think of that one. Give this video a like. If there's anyone in your community who's really into DIY and they haven't perhaps taken that first step to actually jump in and make their own products. So it's a lot of fun. I will be back uh, same time tomorrow with another recipe. And um, yeah, I just hope you guys get really uh, creative and jump into making some gifts this Christmas. So if you have any questions, just leave it below and I will get back to you um, and I will see you guys tomorrow. See ya.